Hey kids, Keys are here. It's time. It's time for the finals. If you saw the uh, semifinals, or I guess what I call them, the qualifying heats. <laughs> uh, what we did is we went through all these cars, and then this was the cream of the crop. These 14, is that right? Yeah, 14. And these were the, actually the top three. We were kind of all tied. I couldn't really pick one. Um, so what I did is uh, when I reset this up for the finals, I added a couple lengths. Actually, I just added one. That's all I could fit in. I might even go longer if we get to the same problem at the end of this one. But it's all about this one double lane curve that I got on eBay. Vintage. This is like from the original year, I'm pretty sure. 68 really close if not but yeah in great shape didn't have to tape it or anything actually I did put a little sticky stuff underneath there so it wouldn't go back and forth but yeah so uh, because of that I thought okay yeah we got to do some head-to-head uh, -head matches here and we did the whole collection and like I said we're down to these 14 cars and since I wanted to do uh, a, a nice pyramid I didn't want to have seven finishers I wanted to have eight we went and grabbed two off the uh, the rack that we wanted to open up eventually. So here's one of them. What is that? That's the uh, 58 Corvette. Pretty cool. Looks like his hood opens up. Yep. <laughs> Doesn't feel um, very hefty, so probably not going to be a great racer. And then the other one is the, uh, I think it's the, yeah, the Ferrari 2. Oh, now this one's got some, uh, some density there. I like this one. Oof. Cool. Yeah, that's all metal on top. All right, so that's going to be our first race. These two guys. Let's get rid of the packaging here and throw it in with the other trash. All right, so there we go. Those are, we're going to match them up. That's kind of randomly together there. We'll get down to three cars, and then we'll match up against the, the known winners. Anyway... Here we go. All right, first up, there's the Ferrari. There's the Corvette. Any marks? You get set. You can even make it all the way here. Yeah, there you go. Barely. Yeah, so we know all of these cars here make made it to the end. But remember, we added a piece of track. So this guy, oh, he looks great. He's definitely going to be uh, up on the shelf with him, probably by the end of the day. But yeah, he can't roll for beans. So losers go there. Um, <laughs> even though he won that race, he's uh, probably going to end up in last place. So yeah, so we'll put the winners there. Actually, everybody wants to roll this way, so fine, you all can roll that way. And put the winners here. Okay, winners going that way, I guess. All right, next up, we got the Model Three, and I'm always forgetting what this guy is. Plymouth Barracuda. Yeah, I know this guy cruises. And I think he uh, will make it to the end because I used him to test the track. Here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. But that Tesla, it can roll. It definitely shot out of there. But there is um, definitely a advantage to being in the outside lane, lane four. Let's see if this proves it. If the Barracuda wins. No, still the Tesla. Oh, nice. That's good to see that the difference between the tracks is not that big. But yeah, but now you can see, because that, for some reason, that outside lane really kicks it. And so if you're a good roller, you might even catch him. It almost happened. Oh, it did happen, lane four. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to go see that one again. That was a close. Yeah, perfect example. This guy can roll. All right, so you go in the winner's circle. 
Ah, poor Barracuda. Wah, wah. All right. Next up, another one I keep forgetting the name of. I think it's um, Maelstrom. Yeah, I'm starting to remember. Now this guy's got a nice racing feel, real dense, real low. And then he's going up against, we all know the Wasp. Keeps showing up in all these different track tests. And she's at the top of this one as well. Oh, wow, bad start for her. But she can roll, look at that. Roll, barely makes it. Maelstrom doesn't even get through the gate. All right, well, let's switch them up. Now Maelstrom gets to the nice lane. There he goes. Yep. He's got that density, so he just kicks him around that turn. Ah! Yeah, I ran into that during the uh, trials. That uh, outside lane, definite advantage. Uh-oh. Better start for Maelstrom, but yeah, there you go. That kick from the outside lane. Whoa, didn't even make it through. Let's switch again. Got to pick a winner between these two. Got to win two in a row. How about that? Good start. There's Maelstrom. Lane four. Winner, lane four. <laughs> okay, let's see if he can win in lane three. That's what makes the difference. Better start. But here comes the Wasp, lane four. Oh, they didn't even make it through. Oh my gosh. What does that tell us? Hmm. Switch again. You know what that's going to tell me? It's going to tell me that nobody won that one. So if Maelstrom won this one, even though it's yeah, lane four, he's the winner. For some reason, nobody makes it when he's not in four. So we're going to call him. Moving on. Uh, poor Wasp. But hopefully somebody beats Maelstrom so she won't feel so bad. All right, next up, Corvette. Which one is it? Hmm, doesn't say. Original model is 75. Luck of the draw, he gets lane four to start. And this should be the other Corvette, one of them. Another no namer. I gotta remember that so I quit looking. There we go. Mm, close, close, close. Blue vet takes it. In three. Ooh, ooh. Which means he's definitely gonna take it in four with that advantage. Bring gets kicked and whoa! He took it. But not till the end. Nice. At least we don't have to uh, argue about it. Gave it a good go. Okay, next up. Power Rage. Up against, I think that's the Charger RT. Yep, he was uh, top of some track test recently. I think the one where you... he's the only one that made it all around all the boosters. And wow, he gets past in the straightaway. Okay, let's see if it helps him to be in lane four. I don't think so. Nope. Oh! No! No, Power Rage still squeaked it out. Two in a row. Power Rage sticks around. Charger takes a hike. 
Too bad I love the looks of this one. Okay, next up, another charger? What is this? Do not say. Hm. Any guesses? Any clues? Nice paint job. Well, you get to start in four there, buddy. And then we have the uh, Corvette. What year is that? Oh, 80s? Is that the, just the generic one? Oh, I love that car. That is awesome. All right, here we go. Ooh. And he was in three. Let's see how he does in four. Should do even better. No. Whoa. Whoa. That's a shocker. Lane three was better for both of them. Hmm. Crazy. So we did not switch them up. We're doing the same ones we had the first race. Whoa. Whoa. Uh oh. Now we're switching them up. Last chance. If you don't win in four, you're out. Ah. Uh, oh well. You may look awesome, but you uh, you're not a winner in this race. I'm sorry. Good thing we're carpeting in that tile. <laughs> All right, the list of or the group of losers is growing. Two more races here, and then we'll get to try them against the uh, cream of the crop. Which one is this? It's another no name. And he's going up against <laughs> another guy that keeps showing up at the end of these races. Octanium or something like that. Octanium. <laughs> Why can't I remember that? I've only like looked at that twenty times. Here we go. Oh, he fades in the stretch. Let's see if the uh, extra kick is going to help him. Nope. Not meant to be. <laughs> but he was another fi finalist in another event. So here we go. C6 Corvette. I got him memorized. His yellow version is one of the top ones. So he should do it. Should do good, good, good. And he's going up against Oh a Chrysler. Wow, they're actually gonna tell us. Oh a Viper! Woo, they can get the name. Yes. This is the Viper. Can I remember that without having a look again? Probably not. Anyway, cool looking. Can you beat the Corvette? Here we go. On your marks. Get set. No. And he even had lane four, which means he's got little chance of beating the vet in lane three. But here he goes. Here we go. All right. There we have it. Down to our eight cars. Now, we're going to go down to three. Put them up against the finals. So we're going to do... Oh, it looks like we have four races here. Hmm. Well, 
We're still going to break them into four winners, so here we go. Just the way they're ordered up. Okay. And that was lane three. Oh, bad start. Oh, but he still almost gets there. Ooh. Which means we're going to do that again since the start was bad. Put him back in four. Better start, but yeah, he's got slow coming down this ramp. No, he didn't make it. We even gave him a second chance. Alright. So there's our finalist. There's our not gonna make it. Ooh. But he still can't. Oh, he had a terrible start. Yeah, that's that lane four kick. Wow, and he even had a crappy start. Watch this one. Let's see if we can do better. That might have been me. That's good. Oh, lane four. Uh-oh, the lane four kick. I think we're going to run into that right here. Okay, back to lane four. Number two in a row when this happens. Good start. There's the kick. So we may have to mix these up with some other cars. We can't have a tie. Here we go. All we want to hear is lane three. Nope. But that was close. That was close. All right, come on, lane three. Nope. Lane four. All right, so you guys are going back in the tray. And we're going to mix you up with the other finalists. So, yeah, this pair goes. See if we got a clear winner. But, yeah, they're all probably about the same speed now, so this might be tough. Here we go. Good, lane three. <laughs> that might bode well. Good start. What? Come on. What happened? <laughs> Whoa. There we go, lane four. But yeah, he he was he was going down really slow. This guy was flying down. Yeah, there's a huge gap at the bottom of the ramp. Here we go. Yeah. Maelstrom's not so hot. I'm rolling down. So there you go. He's out. There's our going on. There's our stand back. And that's right. Those two uh, kind of tied. All right. <laughs> Remember, he barely made it to the finish line, so we don't think he's going to do well at all against the uh, super fast rolling Tesla. Here we go. Look at that. He's loser all the way. Oh, actually, got around that turn good. He just doesn't roll well. All right, so he's getting one chance in lane four. Nope. You can see, he's just behind from the get-go. At least he finished. <laughs> All right. So we got those three. That one. And now these two. This is the order I think that they were in. So these two are going first. Against these two.
And then we'll have three on three. There we go. That'll be good. So he gets a buy because he did so well in the uh, preliminaries. Okay, here we go. I'm betting on the uh, C6. Wow. Barely held him off in lane three, which means in lane four, should be a no-brainer. There he is. He hit the turn early. Oh, my God. Can he roll? Winner! Lane four! All right. Well, we don't see, have to see any more of that. So far, we'll just stick him there, these two. Close, close. Whoa. All right. Is that the lane four kick? Or not? Ooh, behind. And then the kick. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, crap. Okay. One more time. Let's see if it just goes back and forth. Whoever's in lane four, we may have to pull out the. Uh, I think that's a, a vet. Oh no, it's a four. Here comes the four kick. It didn't work that time. Nice. Ah, that way we don't have to sweat it. You barely didn't make it, but man, you fought for it the whole way. Okay. And then the uh, the buy. So it looks like the two white cars. I do believe this is a Porsche Carrera. Yup, yup, yup. 96 version of it. So since he got the buy, he goes in lane three to start with. And he goes up against the Model 3. Battle of the White Cars. Here we go. On your marks. Get set. Go. Good start. Uh -oh. Model 3 may be outclassed. Remember, this is the guy who was the top of the heap. So Model 3 gets one chance in the fourth lane. But that Porsche is on a roll. Yep. Even in lane four, he can't do it. All right. X2. Good start. Nice. The lane four kick. Let's see if it goes back and forth. Of course, we can always get the Porsche to settle it. Ooh, kick. No! Okay. So, uh... Somebody's really proven himself here. Yep. No name. That's always a good excuse for not remembering. Because you never heard it. Okay. Last semifinals, then we're at the finals. There he is, coming through. Now, can he? No, he was in lane three, so now he's in lane four. So he's a he's a shoe in. Yep. Too fast. All right. So yeah, it's gonna come down to the. <laughs> guess what? The three that were already on the podium. What do you know? Almost. These are the guys that almost got there. Just like in the trials, they didn't make it. All right. So here we go. Last but not least, these two. I think this is where we finally decided, okay, they're just going to go back and forth with everyone in lane four winning. So we got a three-way tie again. Oh, great start for the Corvette. 
But here comes the kick. Ah! Wasn't enough though. It wasn't enough though. I don't know if that counts because I was um probably the reason it was a bad start. Here we go. Good start. But there's that outer lane. Whoa, but that is a close race. That's crazy. Hmm. Hmm. I think it might just go back and forth. Let's see how close it is. Oh, bad start. And still almost catches him. <laughs> okay, so let's give you guys a rest. <laughs> and see if either one of you can beat the Porsche. Good start. Outer lane kick. Oh, ho, ho. but it didn't help. It didn't help. Wow, the vet eked it out. Let's see if he can do it in lane three. Wait, he wasn't. Wait, was he? Oh, the vet might, um, look at that. Almost catches him. I think that's what happened last time. Let's go back the other way. You in three, you in four. Good start. Four should take it. No. I think the C6 Corvette is proving uh, to be the better man here. Interesting. All right. Let's give uh, Carrera one more chance in four. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. He didn't do it. And if you can't, can't catch him in four... You're not as fast. So, yeah, I think we have our winner. So, uh, we'll give no, Mr. No Name a chance in lane four to beat the uh, vet. Whoa! And he does. Look at that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's saying not so fast. But can you do it in lane three? If you do, you're the, you're the king of the hill. Good start. But no. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Why would you come off without a good reason? Well, you would have had to bail on the turn for that. Oh, fascinating. Might have caught... Yeah, he's kind of a little on the low side. Might have caught something. All right, well, I can't crown the vet king yet. Here we go. He's in four. Should win. And he doesn't. Well, guess what? I think here it comes. The vet doesn't win in four. We have our new champ. And he doesn't. Bingo. Two in a row. Including giving the vet lane four. I'm going to try one more time. because that that This is the definitive race right here. Vet in four. Yeah, he gets a little jump. Oh, but the vet takes him that time. Okay, come on now. You're going to make it that hard on me? We'll go back again the other way. May have to... Oh! It seems that the... Uh, oh! It catches him in four. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be the same dilemma I had before. Track's too short. I need to extend that and see if we can separate these three. Right now, I'm calling it a tie. If I do that and it's worth uh, taping and showing, then I'll show it. Otherwise, that was it. Three-way tie. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for checking it out. I'm out of here. Laters. Hey, guys. I'm back. I got a quick little addendum here, maybe. 
maybe not because if it turns out the same I'm not going to add this to what you've already seen but remember we have a three-way tie here and so since I'm about to is this thing still on yep I added four more pieces of track see if the extra little length separates these guys so let's just run a few see if it makes a difference do the two top well actually it's the blue one that we think is the top one here we go I hope if I turn the camera right side up whoa okay what did he hit here did I leave something did I like oh oh that was good might help if you put the track together right <laughs> all right my bad not your fault, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, that did not sound like a normal failure. Let's try this again. Whoa, and he catches in the extra track. Yeah, let's see if it goes both ways. Not we have our winner between these two. Whoa! He's getting a mu oh look at this. He got a much better start, but he still got caught. But that lane four kick. Alright, even start, but that yeah, lane four. So sad. But can he beat this guy in lane four? No. Whoa. Whoa. I think uh, the extra track made just enough difference. I'm going to let him have four again. No. Okay, we have our definite winner here. We have our definite winner here. So he definitely should uh, clean up with lane four. Ooh, even with a bad start. Watch this. Yep. Here we go. And then just to be safe, one chance the vet has, and he gets four. Here we go. Good start. Nope. Looks like the extra track. Advantage blue car. Yeah, we don't know his name. We'll quit wasting time looking for it. But yeah, there we go. Winner of the down and back head-to-head -head challenge. I should measure this. See what the scale this was. It was definitely, I think, at least a half a mile. But yeah, shockers of all the cars. This turned out the king of the hill, and he doesn't even have a name. Anyway, thanks for checking it out. Now you know who won. I'll stick it on the end there so you'll see. Geezer out.